right now. So if dogs are members of the family, I mean, they probably should just eat as well as we do, right? Well, just for uh, just food for dogs is what it's called. It's a place that serves whole food recipes made with the same ingredients that humans eat. Ellen Taylor and her dog, Charlie, are there this morning with more. Hi, Ellen. So, Liz, <laughs> look at this. Um, so, Charlie, Annie, and uh, we have Jameson, too. They are all going to taste test this food that we have made. But not only are the dogs going to taste test, we are, too. In fact, actually, you know what? These dogs have been so well behaved. Charlie, look, here. Let's, oh, ready? One, two, three. Here you go, Charlie. Boop. There we go. All right, so while they're taste testing, I am here with Dr. Jessica Wilson, and um, we have been making this food all morning as well, too, and you said that this is like human grade food yeah. and girl i see you, you have a supermarket and grab this absolutely you have a spoon in yours and you do too so are we gonna try this, We're gonna do this. okay while we try this, this you try it first oh yeah and i mean we've made this today this is not one of those like bougie places where it's like oh my gosh out of the way wait really mm -hmm. are you just saying that for tv mm -hmm. is it really that good um but it's really important to make sure that we mm -hmm. feed our dogs you know healthy right things because uh man learning so much about how you know the fda has regulations on people food but not so much on animal food well, as at least well not enforced as well yeah not enforced yeah. as well so um we put whole ingredients in here i'm totally delaying eating this you're on your second <laughs> But um, I'm going to take a bite because I also want to ask mm -hmm. Dr. Wilson about some of these things that we put in here, too, to make sure that our dogs are healthy and taken care of. And okay, here, here, ready? Go ahead. That's actually not it's bad. It's really good, right? It's food. It's yeah. food. It's food. It's real food. Okay, let's talk about so, what we got here. <laughs> I want more. Um, so the things that we added after the fact. So here's the finished kind of product after we've cooked it. But really important to make sure that it's completely balanced is we do have a nutrient blend that comes in our DIY or do-it-yourself kits. And so this has the vitamins and minerals in there um, that will make this recipe completely balanced Got for it. dogs. Um, so there is that. Here we have some safflower seed oil and some omega-3 fatty acid as well. This is actually our own product. And so we add this for the benefits of anti-inflammatory. Um, that uh, makes benefits sense. Um, so that again the diets are completely balanced sure and, yeah. and you know if you're thinking I don't have time to meal prep for myself let alone for my dogs they can do it for you mm -hmm. or um, you don't need to also drive up to Seattle I think a lot of people might be watching let's say in Marysville and you're like I'm not driving to downtown Seattle. I'm not going to deal with parking. I love my dog, but uh, that's too much. Uh, Just Food for Dogs is carried in several Petco's around Western Washington, from Marysville to Olympia, Kirkland, Gig Harbor, Federal Way. Um, all the details are up on their website. Uh, and also, you can tell these guys are now switching and all of them sampling food and stuff, too. And, um, it's all based on different diets as yes. well, too. So, like, my dog, Charlie, he has a little bit of an allergy. Mm -hmm. We gave him a little bit of a venison diet yes. as well, too. But um, real quickly, if I'm watching TV right now and I'm thinking, yes, I love my dog, but really, why can't I just stick with kibble? What would you say to that, Dr. Wilson? Well, it's going to be the equivalent of eating fast food or junk food every single day of your life. Okay. And you know that you will feel much better and you're going to have health benefits when you make the switch to sure. human food. Or human rather, food. we'll say fresh whole food, right, for people. Because yes. it applies for people's and pets as well. Right, right. Um, so it's just something to think about. Uh, also considering the quality of the ingredients. You know what's in this bowl, either because you cooked it yourself, right. sourced the ingredients yourself, or we prepared it for you. Got um, it. And again, having the assurance that all of our recipes are completely balanced, yeah. formulated by veterinarians, have gone through year-long feeding trials, and we were able to prove that our recipes make dogs healthier. That is that reassurance that you're making the right move when switching from that highly processed type of diet to a fresh whole food Well, diet. you know what? I think Charlie approves. Also, what Charlie think, is very Clay? food motivated as well. But you know what? He's 11, so we want him to live for 11 more years. Yes, I'm talking more about longer. you, little guy. Yeah, we want you to live forever. So if you want to get more details, I'll put all of them up on our website, including the recipe at q13fox.com slash Ellen. But for right now, Charlie's going to send it back on over to Liz and Bill. Right? He's like, give me more food. <laughs> Ellen, thank you.